So obviously, you know, this is a passion of mine. I could talk to you guys for an hour on this, but I'll be, uh, I'll give you the uh, abridged version, which is one, everybody now claims to be a medical advisor, right? As I told you, I was on TikTok. And I watch TikTok too, yeah. Old as I am, I still like a, a good TikTok video, right? Well, on there claiming that they're medical advisors. What makes you a medical advisor, right? Understand that I'm a physician. I trained many years to practice medicine. Does that make me a good medical advisor? No. The average physician cannot tell you how to get into medical school. The average physician cannot tell you how to stay in medical school. Okay? That is a unique skill set. All right? Liam Neeson, unique set of skills. Okay? And I believe that many students out there are being misled by a lot of flashy stuff, but they're getting nothing because people are just telling you, they're taking your money and they're just telling you, just study harder at the end of the day. They give you a little flashbang, poof, poof, paf, paf, right? Your money's gone. And at the end of the day, they haven't really told you anything that you couldn't have figured out on your own. Your mother's been telling you study hard, right? You have to pay $3,000 for somebody to essentially tell you that? No. This is a skill that myself and my partner, we have devised a plan that we've used our decades of experience of training people how to excel in medical education. And a lot of this is out of love. It is my desire to share with you a program that worked for me because I learned it from my partner. So I am student now turned teacher working with teacher, right? Kind of like in the, the Shaolin monk movie where the drunken guy starts off and he's like walking through and he's all dirty. And then he gets taken in by the Shaolin master and the Shaolin master trains him. And then at the end of the movie, the two of them are fighting all the bad guys together and the drunk guy is not drunk anymore he's all shaven and he's all fly with his goatee right that's what it is right now which is i learned the process and i want to share that process that is proven to be effective this is not some you know oh just you know join us and we'll teach you how to work hard we have data that has proven how effective our methodology is and has been and we are sharing that with students to get realistic and true results, to not only do better academically, but prepare yourself for a gauntlet of circles and hoops and fire that you're gonna have to get through to get into medical school and be successful in medical school. This is what I am here to do, which is to share that with the other students that may be running into walls, doubting themselves, getting bad advising, right? And let me tell you, I have nothing against advisors, but I can tell you even in schools I've gone to in Cornell and Georgetown and Stanford, big names with big people, that doesn't mean that people in those departments actually know how to advise. Just like you know that there are many brilliant teachers that don't know how to teach. This is what we're here to do is to give you the skills and the know-how as to how to navigate this medical gauntlet and maximize your academic goals by giving you the coaching necessary to change habits and to prepare you for greatness in medicine.